Hello, and welcome to How to Create a Database Instance. After completing this lesson, you will be able to understand basic concepts related to cloud databases, database service instance, as well as demonstrate an example of how to create a service instance on an IBM DB2 warehouse on cloud database. A cloud database is a database service built and accessed through a cloud platform. It serves many of the same functions as traditional databases with the added flexibility of cloud computing. Users install software on a cloud infrastructure to implement the database. Advantages of using cloud databases are ease of use. Users can access cloud databases from virtually anywhere using a vendor's API or web interface. Scalability. Cloud databases can expand their storage capacities during runtime to accommodate changing needs. Organizations only pay for what they use. Disaster recovery. In the event of a natural disaster, equipment failure, or power outage, data is kept secure through backups on remote servers. Few examples of cloud SQL databases are IBM DB2 Warehouse on Cloud, Compose for PostgreSQL, Oracle Database Cloud, Microsoft Azure Cloud, SQL Database, Amazon Relational Database Services, which can run in the cloud, either in a virtual machine or as a service, depending on the vendor. Database services are logical abstractions for managing workloads in a database. Each service represents a workload with common attributes, service level thresholds, and priorities. The grouping is based on attributes of work that might include the application function to be used, the priority of execution for the application function, the job class to be managed, or the data range used in the application function or job class. An instance of the cloud database operates as a service that handles all application requests to work with the data in any of the databases managed by that instance. The database service instance is the target of the connection requests from applications. The application we will be using is Python. When a connection has been completed, your Python code sends SQL statements across the connection to the instance of the database. The database instance then resolves the SQL statements into operations against the data and objects in the database. Any data retrieved is returned to the application. Now let's see how a database instance is created for DB2 Warehouse on Cloud. IBM DB2 Warehouse on Cloud is a SQL database provision for you in the cloud. You can use DB2 Warehouse just as you would use any database software but without the overhead and expense of hardware setup or software installation and maintenance. Among the service plans offered for DB2 Warehouse, you can use the Data Warehouse to store relational data, analyze data using built-in analytics, or by connecting your own apps. The DB2 Warehouse database can be provisioned on IBM Cloud and for AWS. Now let's see how we can set up a service instance of DB2 Warehouse. Navigate to IBM Cloud and select the DB2 Warehouse on Cloud Service. Type a service instance name. Choose the region to deploy to, as well as an org and space for the service. Then click Create. You can view the IBM DB2 Warehouse service that you created on your IBM Cloud dashboard. You should be able to see details related to connection configuration when you open the web console for the DB2 Warehouse on Cloud service. The connection details include the following. A host name, which is a unique name or label assigned to any device that is connected to a specific computer network. A port number, which is the database port. The database name, which is the database name. A user ID, which is the username you'll use to connect. Password is the password you'll use to connect. The version of DB2 Warehouse on Cloud. Thank you for watching this video.